In the bustling world of agriculture, where potatoes reign as a staple crop, a company called J.R. Simplot embarked on a quest to revolutionize the humble spud. They sought to overcome two persistent challenges plaguing the potato industry, bruising and the formation of a potentially harmful chemical compound called acrylamide. Picture this, fields stretching as far as the eye can see, dotted with rows upon rows of potatoes. As these tubers grew, they faced the relentless threat of bruising. It was an unsightly blemish that diminished their quality and reduced their shelf life. For farmers, it meant economic losses, and for consumers, it meant purchasing potatoes that were less than perfect. Meanwhile, the cooking process presented another obstacle. When potatoes were subjected to high temperatures, a chemical reaction occurred, giving rise to acrylamide. This compound, with its potential health risks, had health organizations and regulatory agencies on high alert. They worried about the safety of the beloved potato-based foods we all relished, like crispy French fries, golden potato chips, and succulent roasted potatoes. Driven by a desire to tackle these issues head-on, the Simplot team set out on a scientific journey. They ventured into the intricate realm of genetics, aiming to create a potato that was less prone to bruising and produced lower levels of acrylamide. Within the vast landscape of the potato's genetic makeup, the Simplot scientists searched for specific genes that held the promise of reducing bruising and minimizing acrylamide formation. With unwavering focus, they carefully selected these genes from a variety of sources. Some hailed from the very essence of the potato itself, while others were borrowed from other organisms, chosen for their potential to bestow the desired traits upon their tuberous counterparts. Armed with their genetic arsenal, the scientists embarked on a delicate process. They skillfully inserted these selected genes into the potato's DNA, employing precise and controlled genetic engineering techniques. This transformative step ensured that the potato received the desired genetic enhancements, ultimately equipping it with a newfound ability to resist bruising and produce lower levels of acrylamide. But the journey was far from over. The genetically modified potatoes were subjected to rigorous testing and evaluation, conducted with meticulous care. Agronomic performance was scrutinized, nutritional composition analyzed, and the safety of these new creations carefully assessed. The Simplot team left no stone unturned in their pursuit of excellence, ensuring that the resulting potatoes met the highest standards of quality, both in terms of their characteristics and their impact on human health. The end result was the Simplot Innate Potato, a triumph of science and ingenuity. These spuds showcased reduced bruising, enhancing their quality and extending their shelf life. No longer would farmers suffer significant losses, nor would consumers need to worry about purchasing potatoes marred by unsightly bruises. Furthermore, the innate potato brought a sigh of relief to those concerned about acrylamide. By genetically modifying the potatoes, the Simplot team had successfully lowered acrylamide levels, offering a safer and healthier choice for all potato enthusiasts. From delectable french fries to crunchy chips and perfectly roasted delights, these modified potatoes allowed us to savor our favorite dishes with a newfound peace of mind. As with any groundbreaking innovation, the Simplot Innate Potato underwent rigorous scrutiny. Regulatory evaluations were conducted, ensuring its safety and compliance with regional policies. Approvals were granted in certain countries, heralding a new era in potato production and consumption. And so, the story of the Simplot Innate Potato unfolded, a tale of perseverance, innovation, and a commitment to addressing the challenges that plagued the potato industry. With these genetically modified tubers, farmers could grow their crops with confidence, food processors could offer improved products, and consumers could relish in the knowledge that their beloved potatoes had become even better, both in quality and safety.